We both know you got empty rooms up there. Well, I guess I could do 99 a night. You're so naughty. <laughs> Save up to half off on hotels at Priceline. Welcome back to Stegman Coliseum, the final routines, the Georgia Gym Dogs and the Florida Gators, top ranked teams in the country. And tonight they put away their traditional colors, the red and black and orange and blue for pink. It's Think Pink Night here at Stegman Coliseum and for a great cause. It, it is for breast cancer awareness and to raise funds for breast cancer research. And everyone aware of the drama here in the final routines of this all-important meet between the Gym Dogs and the Gators. This is Katie Keenan. It's amazing that the two top teams in the country can go head-to-head -head and keep a competition so close and at the same time, you know, really do something wonderful for a great cause. They're rivals, but they're coming together here for a good cause. The Gym Dogs with a slight edge in this fourth rotation. Katie Heenan looking for a big score to separate the margin. Leaning on their go-to girl once again here. Katie came through for them with a 9-9 on beam earlier tonight. They want a big score from her on floor. Showing off that great personality. That's definitely something great that Georgia brings to this Georgia team. Not only her confidence and her consistency, but her attitude. She just so looks positive. So, she looks so comfortable out there, Lori. So at ease with her performance. Finishing up big with a double pike. That's the routine that Georgia was hoping for. That's the routine they were depending on. And they got just what they needed from their team leader, the heart and soul of this team, according to her coach. Opening pass, front double twist to a punch front. She does it on what's called a sting mat, and it does just that. It takes the sting out of the ankles on these really high-pressure tumbling elements. Huge score. And that deserves a hug from Coach Yachlin. Now here's Amanda Castillo, the freshman for the Gators. So much pressure, Lori, the final routines on the road at Georgia. Such competition and such tradition in all sports and now in gymnastics. Amanda's just a freshman, but tonight she's performed solid as a senior. The pressure's on now with the tumble series and she's off the beam. Five tenths deduction right there. Big miss. Remember in college gymnastics, six athletes compete, five scores count. So Florida can drop this score. But how difficult is it to remain focused after a fall like that? It's so important not to get wrapped up in your mistake, to continue with the routine and take one skill at a time and to stay focused, especially in an atmosphere like this. This is a great learning experience for Amanda, and this will take her far throughout this season. She's going to be in this position many times at the SEC Championships, Regionals, Nationals. She'll have her chance. Keeping that focus here, you can see it in her face, into a big dismount, a double pike. Well done, she really tried to discipline the landing. She did take the step on the landing. Lori, let's take a look and see what happened. What went wrong here for Amanda? Four inch wide beam, there is a small margin for Erin on this tumble series. You have to be aggressive and stay square. You can see her hips come out of line on the landing. She doesn't pull her chest up for that landing position. But they will drop that score so the Florida Gators, after the beam in the fourth rotation, have a 49.300 overall score in that rotation. So what that means, everybody, is this, that Tiffany Tolme needs a 9.925 for Georgia to tie the visiting Florida Gators in this dual meet. And consider this, a 9.925 would match not only her season high, but her career high. So Tiffany needs a peak performance right now. Coach calls her a rock star. Well, Roxas opening pass, double Arabian, excellent job. She looks poised. Front full, front full in combination.
This is an amazing position to be in. Knowing that you have the goods to do it, competing in front of the home crowd, the energy level here is just amazing. So much fun for Tiffany as a competitor. And great practice for down the road of the SEC championships. Absolutely. We're seeing the tumbling, we're seeing the personality, the clean choreography, leaps and jumps. Third and final tumbling pass. With a hit, the score could come. Amazing double pike, huge smile. She knows she got the job done. Now it's up to the judges. I didn't see many deductions in this routine. She opened strong with a double Arabian. Look at the technique, it's right on. Beautiful height, just a slight leg separation, but no problem with the direction. There's the score, 9925. Can you believe it? A tie between Georgia and Florida. Just like two heavyweights going.